I saw Fat Joe was out here getting a few things off his chest about how serious and how far some rappers are willing to take hip-hop beef. According to Fat Joe, he has realized some rappers have been wishing jail on their opponents after finding out that they have committed a crime or they have been involved in some sort of a case with the law. And Fat Joe think that is wrong. Even though Fat Joe didn't mention any names, Rick Ross was in the comments pointing a finger at 50 Cent and how he has been trolling Diddy since the arrest of Keith D in the Tupac murder case. And a lot of people are also saying that Rick Ross is no angel in that field since he has been doing the same thing to DJ Indy since their car show beef. Let's check it out. Let me tell you about hip hop beef. I done had hip hop beef with everybody, right? But this is when I think hip hop beef goes wrong, right? Because if hip hop is competitive, if DJs are competitive, if rappers are competitive, uh, that's cool. You can diss each other. You know, we see the battle rap. We see what's going on. Everybody diss each other. That's cool. Right? But uh, and to everybody out there, all my friends watching, I love you. If I don't get to tell each and every one of you, I love you. I love you. Okay? And so with hip-hop beef, right? How could the hip hop beef go wrong? So we hate each other, we beefing with each other, we trying to be competitive. Um, when real life issues, real life issues happen, it's where I draw the line and I put the line in the sand, sort of say, right? So if I got beef with another rapper, another DJ, and that guy's fighting the law where he might be going to jail for 10 years, 15 years. I don't think it's cool for hip hop beef to be like, yeah, go get him. He does this, he does that. That's jail. That's jail for 10 years. Now, you think it's hip hop, you think it's fun of games, but R. Kelly's in jail for life. And so the, one of the greatest most famous, most illest entertainers, might be the greatest ever, is in jail for life. I'm not saying what he did or what that, I'm just telling you, you can go to jail. Like, there's no such thing as you're too famous to go to jail. They'll put you in jail. Um, and so I'm talking about everybody, guys. I'm not talking about somebody specific. Specifically, I'm telling you that man that you used to go see in Madison Square Garden, I believe I could fly, is in jail. So anybody can go to jail that's famous. But if I got rap beef with you, it's not cute. For me to so-called try to put your business out there or dirty your face or or point allegations to you because I want more ratings or I want to sell more records. And this has just been really happening lately in an amazing way where guys that I respect and I love are seeing other artists or people in vulnerable positions and are acting like it's hip hop beef. Yeah, he did this. Yeah, he did that. No, he might go to jail for 10 years and not be able to feed his family. And what is it to you that that man goes to jail? This is real life shit. If you have stayed with me to this point of the video, consider subscribing. Hit the like button and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.